Okay, it's time for another Try It Tuesday. Today we'll be trying the um, Bert, Brent, I can't say this word, Brent's Scrambled Tiny Jelly Beans. Yes, I hit the Dollar Tree and Walmart quarter section for this taste test, so we're going to be trying these. There are 24 flavors. We're going to try the Sour Watermelon. Easter Bunny and the watermelon flavor and the blue raspberry flavor and we are going to be trying the strawberry flavor in the water so if you want to know what these things taste like please stay tuned and like almost every video I've done water in we're doing the water first. Oh my goodness. That is very strawberry. Um, but it's not like natural strawberry taste. It's more like... I know. We're not supposed to touch our face. But when it itches, it itches. <laughs> it's like... Um, those little candies you get at Christmas time that's strawberry flavored that's the strawberry flavoring in this um so we're going to go over here we're going to do the easter uh or the jelly beans last we're going to do the easter bunnies first um i'm going to do watermelon then the raspberry so we're going to do watermelon sour easter bunny first um if we can open him come on quarter bunny Time to come out of your wrapper. Okay. Oh my goodness. This smells like a Sour Patch Kid. So here he is. Closer up. Um, there he is. And like I told you, I am the weird person that eats the bottom of the bunny first just me. Oh, that smells very like a Sour Patch Kid. Oh my goodness. Okay. Seriously, Russell Stowers? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. This is white fudge with a sour kick. So, <clears throat> how to explain this? You try to get this white fudge sweetness, but then the sour kick overpowers it big time. So all you can taste is very, very sour watermelon taste with this very, very, very light, creamy fudge taste on the bottom. It's very weird. Um, It doesn't change. I was trying to let that one melt a little to see if it changes from biting into it and chewing it up versus it just melting in your mouth. Same experience if you let it melt. Um, so this is like having a sour patch kid. covered in chocolate and white chocolate. It's 
This is like having a Sour Patch Kids covered in white chocolate. I myself don't like the watermelon flavor. I don't know. Don't have very good hopes for the blueberry either, or the blue raspberry. But we're gonna try it. Oh my goodness! I'm gonna have to get a drink of my water just to cleanse my palate from that. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! That was like so sour. If you like sour, you will love that. So we're going to try the blue raspberry bunny now. Um, this is what he looks like in the little package. This is what he looks like on the back, what he looks on the front. We're going to get a little piece, which it's going to give me a big piece because... Oh, this smells like... Kind of like Captain Crunch, actually. You know those blueberries and Captain Crunch? kind of smells like those. So, I don't know. That's what it looks like. Okay. First off, this one is giving me a lot more of the fudge taste with this the hint of the raspberry taste. This one is actually kind of good. The only problem I really have with this one though is the raspberry has this like aftertaste. I can not like it. I don't know how to explain that. Like if you have like a pack of Kool-Aid. It's kind of going old. Like the pre-sugared Kool-Aid that's kind of been sitting in the cabinet for a while and if you know so it has this little backlash -y weird taste to it. And it might be that this is after Easter and it might taste a lot better actual Easter. But that's the only thing I have a negative about this. Other than that, it's fine. It has blue raspberry and you taste fudge or white chocolate. I like that one better. So out of these two, I like the blue raspberry better. So now I'm going to get another of the water. We're on to the jelly beans. Um, so this has the flavors lemon, angel food cake, mango, co coconut, um, caramel apple, buttered popcorn, coffee, mint chocolate, tangerine, strawberry, green apple, grape, watermelon, chocolate pudding, raspberry, cinnamon, pineapple, cinnamon bun, peach, bubblegum, Blueberry, which is not like blueberries, it's blueberry. Root beer, pe uh, pear, and cherry. So, I'm going to open it up and see how difficult it is to pick all 24 pieces. Colors out of the pack. Okay, so this is the package that comes in inside. So we might have all 24 in here and we might not. It has a tear place. It's okay. I'm trying to 
tear it without tearing it all the complete thing apart, which is not going to happen. So that's how it had to tear. So we're going to use our little color chart and try to figure out what we're eating. Okay, these really dark green ones are supposed to be watermelon. So that's supposed to be watermelon. a good watermelon taste. Um, it's kind of like, I'm trying to think of another candy that's like the watermelon rings you can get from Haribo. Um, or not rings. The watermelon slices, or it looks like little watermelons you can get from Harper, is what it kind of tastes like. Okay. Then the yellow ones. There are possibly three different flavors, actually. This could be lemon, it could be pineapple, or it could be buttered popcorn, because all three of those are yellow. So we're going to see which one it is. And it might actually be pear, too, because it might be light green. Nice lemon. Very, very um, tangy lemon. So that actually kind of actually tastes like a uh, lemon meringue pie kind of lemon. Actually, pretty good. Um, this green speckly one is supposed to be pear. I have just like a pear from Jelly Belly. That's really good, actually. Okay. I'm thinking this one's supposed to be caramel apple. That's wrong. That's actually cinnamon bun. you also have a sweetness to it. So since we just ate cinnamon bun, I'm going to get this red one. I am expecting it to be actual cinnamon. So I think this is actual cinnamon since that was cinnamon bun. We're going to see how much more cinnamon this is without the bun part. Oh yeah. Okay. A lot more cinnamon, a lot more cinnamon than cinnamon bun. The actual cinnamon flavor tastes um, just like a red hot candy or a big red chewing gum. The cinnamon bun actually just tastes cinnamon with like a sugary taste to the end of it. So there are differences. Okay, the orange one is peach or tangerine. So this could possibly be peach and this could possibly be tangerine. Tangerine. It actually does taste kind of like a tangerine. So that's actually a pretty good flavor. Okay. Let's go to a normal one. This is probably this is probably great. Yeah, it's great. Okay. Right. This could be chocolate pudding or coffee because it's more cherry because the cherry does have like a darker 
chocolate. This might be cherry coffee or chocolate pudding. It's cherry, but it's not a good cherry. It's kind of like a medicine tasting cherry, like NyQuil. It's not good at all. But this is a darker brown one. So it's either chocolate pudding or coffee. Coffee. I actually like it because I love coffee. But if you're not into like chocolate covered coffee beans or the actual flavor of coffee, you will not like it. But it kind of tastes like if you've ever had a chocolate covered coffee bean, that's kind of what it tastes like. Okay, and this is another brown one, but it's a little bit lighter, so I'm hoping or thinking that this is probably chocolate pudding. Mm -hmm. Chocolate pudding. Actually, it's a pretty good chocolate flavor. Okay, this one I'm thinking is buttered popcorn. This is a lighter yellow. Yeah, it's buttered popcorn, but it's nowhere. It's nowhere as good as the Jelly Belly one. Okay, this one. I'm thinking it's green apple or mango. It's green apple or mango because they're coloring it about the same. It's mango. Very strong mango flavor, actually. So you really have to like mangoes to like that jelly bean. Okay. I'm trying to find some different colored ones. We might not have all the flavors. Okay, this is a blue berry. Yeah, it tastes like a blueberry. Like the Captain Crunch blueberries. Or Smurf berries. If you're old like me. Do we try the pink one already? The pink speckled one? Watch this. I don't even see the pink speckled one. I think this is supposed to be root beer. Does root beer looks like pink? I'm not sure. Tastes like mango again. I'm trying to say I have a white one. If I really wanted to try coconut, but I don't have any more flavors than that. So you don't get all the flavors in this. You just have a possibility of getting 24 flavors. You don't get all 24. I'm glad I only bought it to pay for a few because that wasn't worth the whole dollar. So, those were alright, but I'm still like Jelly Belly a lot better. Jelly Belly is still my favorite jelly bean. These didn't win me over. Um, and out of these, this for me was awful. But this one was actually pretty good. So, as if, if, okay. <laughs> pretty good, is my review. <laughs> but anyway, um, 
if you like these taste test reviews um, on Tuesdays, please let me know down in the comments down below. Also, while you're down there, click that big um, blue, or it ain't even blue anymore, is it? Click that big thumb that's pointing up and give me a thumbs up. Um, and if you're new here, please do click that big red button. Turn it gray, become a kitten today, because we always have room for a new kitten here, and we love to see the family grow. Um, please be kind to one another. Be safe out there. Enjoy your day. Don't just endure it. And remember, I love you all very, very much.